Is it cruel the way we treat animals now? Give me examples, but be very careful with them. <laughs> Go ahead, Genesis. I know you want to do this. Okay, we're giving it to me. Yes, it is cruel the way we treat animals. I mean, I'll bring PETA back up, but if you go see the videos they share when they go to factories, the way that we are treating the animals that we consume is disgusting. I don't know why an individual would want to put that, like, depressed, sickened meat into our body. It is obviously just changing something about us if we're eating that. Like, we used to eat all natural foods, natural meat with no GMOs in it. And now everything we made is like chemical and it's abused and it's disgusting. Thinking about it right now is making me like nauseous. Okay, but if we talk about PETA, they show like certain factories that are doing that and not every factory does that to animals. Like you have to realize just because one person doesn't doesn't mean that everybody else does it. A vast majority of product makers, like meat makers and stuff though, do abuse their animals even though... Uh, label might say cage free doesn't mean it's really cage free advertisement is key and that's the whole thing like product makers will say whatever it takes to get people to buy their produce when it actually comes down to it humans do not care about animals the way that i believe we should like back like, i'm gonna bring up like indians when they would go hunt their meat they would like have gatherings around it and they would pray over their food and it was like a they would love the animal for giving them their life so they could eat that food. And now it's just like we're selfish and we take whatever we can. Like we we put thousands of hundreds of thousands of chickens squished into like small factory. I'm not even going to put sizes of factories, but just a very small factory where they're just all slumped together in cages. Most of them die and they're just sitting there dead around a bunch of other chickens for days upon days. And that is the chickens that we have eaten every night. Okay, but you have to realize that the supply and demand of food has grown since those years. And so in order for every human in like whatever size the country is, they have to have that or people are going to starve and die because most people won't go out and hunt their own food anymore because they find it as cruel to shoot an animal. So they'd rather just go to the grocery store and buy it or eat it. Unless we just don't eat animals anymore or animal products okay but That's it is why. not healthy to not eat meat whatsoever like it is literally yeah, part of the human body to have. I've, I've, been, I've been for five years now and like out of those five years of my life i think it's been like the best five years health-wise like my body feels a lot better not eating that processed meat with the gmos in it and even before i was vegetarian i would only eat natural everything and i think society lost sight in what's actually good for their bodies and what